Welcome to Arsenal Fans of Single Winning Winning TV. My name is Spence and thank you very much for joining me today for my match preview for that big game down there at the FD Stadium against Manchester City. Yes, a game where we cannot afford to lose if we are to be taken seriously. Yes, I am very excited for this game knowing that last season we, oh, I'm not going to say done the treble over them, but we won the Community Shield. We beat them in the Community Shield and we also... Uh, beat them at home and then also drew against them. So for me, that was 100%, um, uh, I wouldn't say win rate, but uh, success rate over them. But yeah, can we transfer that last season's um, results uh, to this year? Go there, get the three points, play on the front foot, not like last year when we went there. Uh, a lot of the pundits were saying, oh, we, took, we, didn't, we were scared, we didn't want to lose, which we didn't. Um, and they were saying if we'd gone, gone at um, maybe we, we'd have won the title. Who, who, who knows? Maybe we would have done, but uh, it's neither here nor there. But yeah, let's go there because it's still early in the season. If we do lose, there's still uh, plenty of games to uh, p uh, make back up. So, yep, I'm predicting 2 1. Hopefully, I'm right. Um, it's not going to be easy if you look, if you look at our midfield. Very short in the midfield there. Uh, as you know, all the guards injured alongside Marino, who we have not really seen play so far. Also, Jorginho, you know what I mean? He ain't played much, but um, who knows? He's played a couple of games, but he's not 100% yet. Um, also, Partey, for me, he looks a bit leggy. It's not giving away the ball, sloppy, not doing the right things at the right moments, uh, giving the ball away cheaply. But yes, we welcome back Declan Rice into the fold because don't forget that uh, one match ban he had, that uh, red card received um, um, uh, at that Bright um, Brighton game. Yeah, so welcome him back into the midfield. Hopefully, he might put, uh, we'll see who Arteta picks to part, partner him in that game. But yes, um, as you know, the attacking uh, front uh, three, I should say four, it's not the same um, without Odegaard creativity. So it's, it's very interesting. If you've watched the last few games, we've been playing very defensive. Uh, Arteta chose to play play more defensive, but then more attacking, which is uh, every man behind the ball. As soon as we lose the ball, everyone gets back into position, into shape, making it hard for the opposition, which has um, worked quite well for us now uh, so far. So hopefully uh, long may that continue. But yes, like I said, I'm looking forward to that game tomorrow. Uh, like I said, nothing. Well, I'm hoping for three points. Hopefully, we can go there. I'm not too sure about in, any injuries for Man City. There was talk of Odegaard maybe carrying a knock. If you, I think during last week's game in the Champions League, shall I say, he, he went down. So who knows? But I'm not wishing any injuries on any players. Uh, I want every every player um, playing. So there's no excuses <laughs> to say he was out or he was out. Not like Tottenham's when we had our players out, they were ranting and raving that they were going to beat us, and they didn't. But anyway, lesser lesser them. But um, yeah, big like I said, big big game tomorrow. What's your views on the game? Do you think we can go there and get the three points? Leave the comments um below. Uh, so yeah, so. It's all kicking off now. We've had uh, our start of um, our season been very tough, as you know. We've had, we've beat Villa. We've had some quite top team. With, uh, I won't call Tottenham top team, but we had Tottenham. We've had Atalanta, and we've had now we've got Man City. So let's see where it takes us. So yes, so if you do like my video, please do subscribe to my channel. Um, smash the like button. Leave any comments in the comments below, and I'll see you all very soon thank you all for watching and come on you gunners